Our programs offer many languages. Please visit suprememastertv.com forward slash schedule. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. It's like, look at this. Look what's happening. It's finally happening. Ready to work my arms. This is going to be a spectacular evening. Laughing the Silent Tears, the musical, part one of a multi-part series. Please continue watching to find out more. Vegan, because our resources are depleting. If you ever visit Denmark, you will be greeted hi, meaning hi in Danish. I'm Lizzie. The beautiful people of Denmark wish that heaven protects your precious life. May you be in tune with a divine melody. Loving the Silent Tears is a Broadway-style musical inspired by Supreme Master Ching Hai's profound poetry collection, Silent Tears. Directed by Tony nominee Vincent Patterson, with choreography by Emmy winner Bonnie Story, the musical takes us on a magical train ride to 16 countries across six continents. It's a journey of fantastic dances and songs, performed by award-winning artists from around the world, as well as a voyage of finding inner peace. This extraordinary musical was premiered on October 27, 2012 at the Grand Shrine Auditorium in Los Angeles, California, USA to commemorate the 19th anniversary of Supreme Master Ching Hai Day. In our series of programs, we are privileged to invite you to join this amazing musical ride. Let's begin with part one. Loving the Silent Tears was a phenomenal the notion show. of world peace were to ever find its place to the stage, it would be the in the form tears. of Loving the Silent Tears. Loving the Silent Tears happening. It was a kind of Loving the Silent Tears. You got to sign for the Supreme Master Ching Hai is a world-renowned Master Ching Hai. Loving the Silent Tears. Loving the Loving the Loving the Silent Tears. 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 Loving the Loving the Silent Tears. This new musical has certainly made its presence known in Los Angeles. Happy Shrine Auditorium there, Los Angeles. Celebrating the work of Supreme Master Ching Hai. Honoring the benevolent work of the world-renowned spirit. We're here live at the red carpet of Loving the Silent Tears. It's a musical that brings all the international superstars to one place, and that's here. The Oscar-winning actor from West Side Story, George Chakira. In USA, Rudy has Nita Lost Boys for She's a Tony winner for Best Featured Actress in a Musical. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. It's like, look at this. Look what's happening. The, the carpet is so lively and everyone's ready to go. It's just a real celebration of world culture. It's amazing, you know, when I was walking down the carpet, there's so many different cultures. It's great to be involved. I just can't believe how big the production is. Very excited. There is so much spectacle and warmth. It's definitely unlike any other red carpet I've been to. How about you? I've been in a couple of one. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> the Oscars and the Grammys, but this is uh, yeah. different. It's very beautiful. Absolutely. And you've been to so many different red carpet events here in Hollywood. What do you think makes this one stand out the most? I mean, just let's take a quick look around. For God's sakes, oh my God, it's beautiful. Have you ever seen anything like this? And your 
You're a two-time Grammy Award winner. Yes, yes, and I feel very excited to be a part of the show. Absolutely, and what made you decide to get in as part of the project? Well, I think it's the, it's the message itself. Very happy that I wrote a song for it, along with the Supreme Master. And when I read the poem, the message kind of kind of spoke for itself. Love, forgiveness, understanding. Those messages we need today more than ever. Absolutely, and those messages are so universal. We can relate to them no matter what culture we're from, right? What? No matter what. <laughs> 记者现在所在的地方是著名的洛杉矶圣殿大礼堂，在这里举办过奥斯卡，举办过格莱美。那等一下，《真爱沉默的眼泪》即将在这里上演。واقعا میشه گفت کارشناسترین محبوب ترین موفق ترین افرادی که در دنیای تئاتر و موزیکال کار میکنن امروز اینجا هستن. Grammy Award winners, Tony Award winners, directors and producers and composers who have won awards from all around the world, pouring their hearts and soul into one musical. Emmy winning, Don't Have Sorrow. Creative collaborations can be tough and this one was just magical. It's an astonishing group of people that they have pulled together. Welcome to Emmy winning choreographer of high school musical Body Story. The execution from uh, Vincent Patterson, I mean, he worked with Michael Jackson for 17 years, come on. You know, it's amazing, the uh, Bonnie Stories choreography, the arrangements from Doug Katsados, all the composers, Oscar, Emmy, Tony winners, Grammy winners, and little old me. Yeah, <laughs> it's a thrill. Two-time Oscar winning composer, Al Pasha. I created the show. I wanted to think of a show that would reach the whole world. 16 countries and six continents. Dance styles are very different in different countries. How did you even start putting together a choreography piece for this? Well, I did a lot of research. <laughs> a lot of a lot of research. Jody Watley, Grammy winning. Vince Patterson as our director. It's a dream come true for me to have, you know, met him now and work with him. It's been nothing but joyful and full of love, so I hope that comes across to the audience and uh, I hope they feel the same way that we do. Look at this, beautiful. There is such beautiful energy here. The atmosphere is bursting in excitement as thousands of theater goers arrive, including Hollywood celebrities. 音乐剧汇集了很多来自百老汇的著名艺人和来自全球各国的知名歌手。现在我们一起来看一看红毯上有哪些明星会出现。This is all about peace, love, and goodwill. So tonight I am an ambassador for all three. Before I was on NCIS Los Angeles, um, I was on Broadway. So, you know, music and theater and dance is like very a, par a part of me. Showed a lot of interest in the show, heard a lot about it. So I thought I'd come down and enjoy the arts. This is going to be a very interesting event. It's so multicultural. There's so many different things that are going to be going on in this show. So many very, very talented people that I can't wait to see it. I wouldn't have given this a miss for anything. I've been looking forward to seeing this ever since I heard about it. Really great. I've never been to anything like this before. I just came like three days ago from Paris. Did you come particularly for this event or of course? Definitely I did uh, just for this event. I enjoyed your work on Chuck for many years. You're fantastic. So what made you want to be a part of this event? It was based on just a feeling um, that I should be out here, and uh, hopefully I'll learn something. The energy, energy is wonderful, and bravo, Supreme Master Ching Hai. Such a beautiful poem. It's a semi-historical situation for this one piece. We have representation of Iran, of Lebanon, and Israel for the first time on stage together. It's time for people to sort of embrace the sort of higher concept of peace. And this is a really powerful moment for me. And just to be able to sing with them on the same stage is just a proof that we can have خب ببینید وقتی سیاست بین ما دیوار میذاره من فکر کنم این موقعی خوبی باشه که ما با موزیک دیوارا رو بشکنیم و فکر کنم 
followed the, the teachings of Master Ching Hai. And yes, I'm a big fan, and I think she's so wonderful and so eloquently spoken. And this is going to be beautiful to be able to take her words and make them into a musical. I got a copy of, of The Silent Tears, the poems, and I just was floored. And her and her teachings, I'm just, it's so beautiful. Absolutely peace and love. I mean, she just emulates that. When you're inspired by poetry in the way that Al Kasha was, tremendous things happen. I'm very honored to be a part of this extraordinary event and celebrating the 19th anniversary of Chiang Hai Day. Today's event is a beautiful, spiritual, uplifting, amazing. It's a true representation of world peace and all beings being one. All beings on this planet have the right to live in peace and harmony together. That's right. Dignified, prestigious event. Supreme Master Ching Hai is high on my list. Uh, anybody who services love, peace, goodwill towards men, to fellow man, is right up there in my book. Supreme Master Ching Hai, my name is Gina LaPiano. We are so pleased and honored to be here to share your day with you. Greetings, Supreme Master Ching Hai, Supreme Master Ching Hai. Happy anniversary, congratulations. Congratulations. On your 19th anniversary. Our Supreme Master Ching Hai Day, what a great job. Happy that this wonderful day has come to pass. You are a beacon in, in the world today, and I'm very proud of what you're doing for everybody. And uh, tell her I'm a big fan of her work. Thank you for all you do to bring compassion to our wonderful world. We think that you're just wonderful. Congratulations on your 19th anniversary. I'm looking forward to 90. Supreme Master Ching Hai Day. This is a fabulous event and we're honored to be here. I'm really here to celebrate the 19th anniversary of the Supreme Master. I think it's wonderful. great. A great salute. Right. And I think it's a great salute to the Supreme Master. I'm looking to find my inner peace. That we can't find our inner peace after all this. The Tony winning actor, dancer, and singer from Billy Elliot, the musical, Carol Coolidge. I appreciate everything Supreme Master has done and is doing. It's really, really inspiring and a great message, and I think the whole world needs some of it. She's a Chinese platinum pop star and a vegetarian. Turn this way. You are a jewel of the Orient. Woo! Thank yeah. You. Oh, this is my first time to Hollywood, the red carpet. So, I'm very excited. People from all around the world. So, so, the whole world, many, many people from different places came to support us. So, I'm very excited. No matter where you're from, no matter what language you speak, everyone is looking for a path to spiritual betterment. And uh, this musical has embodied the, the search that all of us go on to what is the meaning of life, what happens to me, why am I here? I hope that this is the start of a trend. Pop star, It's a spiritual journey from the lead characters. All the different countries are there to help them along their way. I'm very happy to be representing the continent of Australia. I think it's going to be fantastic. I'm from Brazil, representing my country of Brazil with the samba. Can you show us some sample samba moves? Sure. I'm up in the air playing a harp and singing, and I have my own troupe of Irish dancers, and really, it's like being a queen. Using our cultures to really share it with as many people as possible. So I'm really, really honored. Korean pop star Brian Tu. Hi, Brian. Oh my God. I want to tell you, I want to meet you so much oh, really? tonight. Yeah, because you started the whole K pop thing, man. Oh. And look, you have so many fans surrounding us right now. This is mind blowing right now. I did not expect this at all. Today, since the musical is about all these international countries coming together for peace. And we're singing uh, poems, the poetry from Supreme Master Chihuahua. We speak up all the Caribbean people them all over the world, and this event here is really a special event for us. Unity and one love. All respect due to the Supreme Master, Shanghai. I love her. I've not, never met her before, but it would be a pleasure to meet her. You know, I'd like to really sit down and just look at her. In the fantasy of the story, I play this French... I look a little bit like Snow White, I think. 
<laughs> in my dress. I love the dress. And uh, the song uh, is called Accept Me The Way I Am. We're doing it part in French, part in English, so that everyone can understand the message. Thank you. A peu à gauche, s'il vous plaît. Voilà. It's not often that a musical at that level are, um, are conveying a message so powerful. So I really am glad to be part of this. Of course, promoting veganism, which the Supreme Master is so wonderful about. And you said you were a vegetarian. What made you want to take that step? Eight years ago, um, it was something that I really wanted to try, being the animal lover and activist that I am, so I just did it. And I was so amazed at how much easier it was than I thought it was going to be. And I felt spiritually, I just felt so great. And I think they're changing my mind to become a vegan, actually. Fantastic. <laughs> everybody's so happy and healthy. Ladies and gentlemen, Patty Kohenauer, Mr. Luke Ebro, Junior Pace. Excited, just a little nervous, but it's okay. <laughs> it's going to be really fun. It's a musical extravaganza. Oh, it's an extravaganza. So much to look at, so much to take in. So I know everyone's going to have a wonderful time. Our viewers absolutely cannot wait for Loving the Silent Tears. What can they expect? They can just expect the most beautiful, over the top, dancing, singing. It's a very touching musical. Maybe you may need one of two tissues. It's been one of the most rewarding experiences of my career and I've done a lot of great things. Now we've all seen shows like Cats with singing and dancing and this show will have all of that but underneath it all there's a deeper layer, a spiritual journey, a human journey that will touch the hearts of its audience. The wonder, the magic, that is everything about loving this island here. It's finally happening. Ready to work my arms. This is going to be a spectacular evening. I think there's going to be some real fun surprises as well. It's going to be a really unique and exciting show to watch. It will be unforgettable. I just can't wait. Ready to go. Have fun. It's been considered that meat is like a drug. It has a substance that causes temptation in the human body. So there exists a temptation of many years which is hard to discard. Vaya Sahin Bau, vegetarian. Kind viewers, we appreciate your company today for Loving the Silent Tears, the musical, part one of a multi-part series. Please join us again on Friday for part two. Up next is Catherine Kelleher, Vegan, the Heroic Rescuer of Hen People, Part 2 of 2, right after Noteworthy News. May we all pray for a peaceful world. Our programs offer many languages. Please visit suprememastertv.com forward slash schedule and suprememastertv.com forward slash AJAR. Nos programs offer plusieurs langues. Veuillez visiter suprememastertv.com bar oblique schedule et suprememastertv.com bar oblique AJAR. Nuestros programas ofrecen varios idiomas. Visiten suprememastertv.com barra inclinada schedule y suprememastertv.com barra inclinada AJAR. Nuestros programas предлагают много языques. Пожалуйста, посмотрите suprememastertv.com, касая черта schedule, и suprememastertv.com, касая черта AJAR. Our programs offer many languages. Please visit suprememastertv.com forward slash schedule. Nos programs offer plusieurs langues. Veuillez visiter suprememastertv.com bar oblique schedule. Nuestros programas ofrecen varios idiomas. Visiten suprememastertv.com barra inclinada schedule. Манай нэтрлгүүд олон хэлээр гардаг. Зочлох хаяг suprememastertv.com тэшүүд руас schedule. Involved in this musical 
Loving the Silent Tears, the musical, part 2 of a multi-part series. Please continue watching to find out more. Vegan, your seat is reserved in heaven. If you visit Denmark, the people would love to hear your laughter and greet you with good day, which means good day in Danish. I'm Lizzie. The delighted people of Denmark wish that you have a loving and pure heart that radiates kindness to all living beings. May all of God's creations live in peace and harmony. Loving the Silent Tears is a Broadway-style musical inspired by Supreme Master Ching Hai's profound poetry collection, Silent Tears. Directed by Tony nominee Vincent Patterson, with choreography by Emmy winner Bonnie Story, the musical takes us on a magical train ride to 16 countries across six continents. It's a journey of fantastic dances and songs, performed by award-winning artists from around the world, as well as a voyage of finding inner peace. This extraordinary musical was premiered on October 27, 2012 at the Grand Shrine Auditorium in Los Angeles, California, USA to commemorate the 19th anniversary of Supreme Master Ching Hai Day. In our series of programs, we are privileged to invite you to join this amazing musical ride. Let's continue with part two. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Loving the Silent Tears.
Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome two-time Emmy award-winning actor and vegetarian Christophe St. John and vegetarian actress and television host Kelly Packard. Good evening, beautiful audience tonight, and these are gifts from heaven, right? They sure are. Silent Tears, a poetry collection by Supreme Master Chang Hai, and the program book for tonight's show. All right, Dream World Cirque, ladies and gentlemen, the aerialists were Jenna Carpenter and Kyle Deshawn. Give it up for them. I got to be honest with you. I am so wishing that I could fly like that, Kelly. How many good deeds do you need to do to become an angel, do you know? Mm, I don't know. Because if it's one or less, you know, I'm, I'm totally in, right? <laughs> you do good deeds all the time. You're a vegetarian. Whoa, yeah. and so are you. <laughs> all right, today we are excited and we are honored to see all of you here tonight, including government officials, uh, media members, and celebrities among us. We also want to thank all of the international fans and media flying in for the fantastic show ahead. Yes, and we'd like to give a big hello to the worldwide viewers watching live right now. Hello. <laughs> yeah, it's... <laughs> it is. It's certainly remarkable in this day and age with technology making this truly a, a global a event. A global event, yeah. that's right. Loving the Silent Tears, the new musical that we're all excited to see. It's a tribute to a vegan spiritual master, a humanitarian, a poet, and an artist whose work uplifts and inspires. Supreme Master Cheng Hai. And the show commemorates the 19th anniversary of the Supreme Master Cheng Hai Day to honor her humanitarian works and advocacy of peace. Yes, and for today's sub, yes, again, yes. Uh, for <laughs> For today's celebration, we are joined by an important guest who would like to convey his appreciation to the Supreme Master Cheng Hai. Please welcome California State Senator, the Honorable Kern Price. Hello, it's an honor to be with you. I want to give you greetings from the 26th Senate District uh, here in the state of California and as chair of the Joint Committee on the Arts. It really is a pleasure to welcome you here to this wonderful celebration as we celebrate the grand poetry and the works of Supreme Master Ching Hai. I think it's significant that we are here in Los Angeles, the multicultural, multi-ethnic uh, capital of the world. Uh, and we know that you will enjoy this program and it's an apt and a very important tribute uh, to a woman who has demonstrated her commitment to uh, humanity, uh, to the arts, and to our society. And so I hope you will enjoy the show. Thank you. And now, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome vegan television host, actress and former Miss USA, Susie Castillo, and vegetarian award-winning actor, Corey Feldman. Well, hello there. <laughs> <laughs> How y'all doing? <laughs> All the way back there. It's great to be here today with everyone, and of course with my beautiful co-host, Susie. Well, thank you very much, Mr. Corey, and I'm excited to be here on so many levels. Not only and I'm, am I a big fan of yours, of course, growing up thank watching you. your films and everything, but this musical is going to be absolutely fantastic. You bet it is. Yes. I can't wait. Loving the Silent Tears is based on the poem collection titled Silent Tears, written by Supreme Master Ching Hai years ago in her 30s. Yeah, and two-time Oscar-winning composer Al Kesha, who is here today in the audience. Very talented man. That's right. Al Kesha was actually inspired by the idea of turning her profound, heartfelt, and humorous poems into a musical. It's really, really so special. So now, everybody, get ready for one incredible journey around the world to 16 countries, all on one stage. Yeah, and thank God it's a really big one. Yeah, 
Thank God for that. We're going to fit them all on here. <laughs> yes, we are. <laughs> Before we enjoy the musical, we would like to introduce our very, very special guest speaker. That's right. Generations know him for his Oscar-winning role as Bernardo in the musical film classic West Side Story. A living legend. Please welcome the wonderful George Akiris. <laughs> Okay. Hello. Hi, everybody. Hello, everybody. I'm happy to be here this evening. I've had the privilege of performing in the theater for many years. West Side Story was a life-changing experience for me. I've loved acting, singing, and dancing since I was a kid. And I'm pleased today to tell you about someone who has a great appreciation for the arts. She is herself an accomplished poet and artist, but she is known throughout the world as a spiritual master and humanitarian. I admire the noble values which Supreme Master Ching Hai represents. Today is the celebration of the 19th anniversary of Supreme Master Ching Hai Day. This day was proclaimed in 1993 by Honolulu Mayor Frank F. Fossey, who wished to honor her for her philanthropic contributions. And all around the globe, Supreme Master Ching Hai has helped disaster victims, the homeless, orphans, veterans, and many, many others. And she also loves the arts, because it's the arts that bring us together. We're all here tonight for the premiere of Loving the Silent Tears, an international musical. And Supreme Master Ching Hai's message is that all beings are the same, human or animal, and have the right to live in peace and dignity on this beautiful planet. And that each person can do his or her part to save lives, better our planet, and be heroes. And my personal way to be a hero and save these important, incredible lives is to be a vegetarian. It is in this caring spirit that this celebration of the 19th anniversary of Supreme Master Ching Hai Day takes place. And I now invite you to watch this video greeting by the inspirational lady herself, Supreme Master Ching Hai. and love. My sincere thanks to all who give your heart to this music assembly. Congratulations to you and the audience for this rare and joyful event. It is good that we still can celebrate in whichever way the beautiful life on earth has given by God. It is good that we still love, still enjoy, to share our goodness to all that coexist in this world and the next. It is good that we still believe in everything that is noble and positive, and heavenly power will definitely prevail. To all involved in this musical event, blessed be your dedication to make this world a more enjoyable place. Cheering up the mass and giving thanks to heaven and earth in this way. Though I possibly couldn't watch the event, and though I'm not aware of the content of the program in advance, I trust that it will be great, and all who watch it will enjoy hugely. Sorry, there is no high tech where I do intensive meditation at present. So this simple message will serve to convey my gratitude to you all and wish you success, happiness, 
and as a token of love I share with you, with me. Maybe this will help pacify our worrying heart. Our heart is concerned about the survival and wellness of all in this world. And that good news is our planet will still be blessed to exist for 10,000 years more to come and continue depending on our goodness in the future. And for that, praise be God. Thanks to all co-inhabitants, loving prayers and contributions in different aspects. As for my humble self, my humble self also continue our best to support our common united endeavor to save this planet for this generation and countless next. Enjoy the show. Thank you all again. May God bless the universe and protect our world. Love you. With all of the ethical problems with eating animal products, it is clear that there can no longer be any justification for eating animals, and we have no choice but to move towards a more vegan world. Rabbi Boris Dahlin, Vegan Radiant viewers, we appreciate your company today for Loving the Silent Tears, the musical, part 2 of a multi-part series. Please join us again next Tuesday, June 14th, for part 3. Up next is The Brilliance of Bird People, right after Noody News. May your high spirit outshine every day. Our programs offer many languages. Please visit suprememastertv.com forward slash schedule and suprememastertv.com forward slash AJAR.